my dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus a very good morning and welcome to this morning blessing prayer and eighth day of novena of the holy spirit the word of god is from saint paul's first letter to the corinthians chapter 6 words 19 and 20 or do you not know that your body is a temple of the holy spirit within you which you have from god and that you are not your own for you were bought with a price therefore glorify god in your body my dear brothers and sisters in christ jesus today we pray for the fruit of modesty modesty ensures and supports purity of heart this is a gift that enable us to see god's plan for personal relationship sexuality and marriage modesty protects the mystery of persons and their love today we pray that the holy spirit may bless us with the fruit of modesty amen bend the stubborn heart and will melt the frozen warm the chill guide the steps that go astray come o blessed spirit of wisdom strengthen my faith increase my hope perfect my charity father enlighten us each day in the silence of our hearts to discern the voice of your spirit to do what he asks of us and to understand the gifts he freely gives us we ask this through christ our lord amen our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and do not let us fall into temptation but deliver us from evil amen hail mary full of grace the lord is with you blessed are you among women and blessed is the fruit of your womb jesus holy mary mother of god pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death amen glory be to the father and to the son and to the holy spirit as it was in the beginning is now and ever shall be world without end amen now we pray for the holy spirit fill me o lord with your holy spirit as you have promised provide me o lord the seven gifts nine fruits and nine charisms of the holy spirit help me o holy spirit to stand in witness of jesus christ and proclaim that he is the lord amen 